Hey, it's JD Adventures again. So, uh, another video of uh, hiking right now. I'm on uh, the trail that goes up to Ben Lomond Peak. It uh, starts on the North Ogden Divide. And then uh, it's about 8.3 miles or so to the peak that's at I think it's 9,600 feet. And the North Hogna Divide starts at 6,000, about 6,100 feet. So if you like my videos, why don't you give me a thumbs up? And if you're new to my, my uh, channel, subscribe and follow me. Kind of what I'm gonna talk about today is uh, is your life important? Um, the reason why I'm doing this channel is I had a lot of uh, people I talked to that said with all the different things that I do, they thought it'd be pretty cool that I maybe did a YouTube channel and kind of recorded it and shared it with people. I thought for a little bit and yeah, I could do that. But part of it was I wanted to inspire people probably. I'm 57. Um, had an ACL replaced in my right knee about 2001. But uh, I've had doctors tell me, ah, you know, you need to be careful. You'll get a full knee replacement. I'm like, whatever. I'm an athlete. I ran marathons when I was younger, ran cross country and track in high school. And uh, you're telling an athlete to sit down. Eh, that doesn't work. But I know there's a lot of people that wasn't that kind of person. They weren't an athlete. They didn't exercise when they're younger. Maybe they want to try something. Maybe even just hiking once in a while get to see the nature I mean look at this this is beautiful so this overgrowth just kind of amazing how it as you're walking up the trail here just beautiful and uh, as you get higher up on this trail you can look overlook the valley of Ogden Valley amazing views but back to is your life important <laughs> Many of us have hard things going on all the time. It sucks sometimes. But uh, I just want to say that even if you don't realize it, there are people that you will inspire. Or maybe they just feel like you're a good friend. And you are important in life. Every person may influence someone and you may not even know it in all the different things that we do throughout our days. We may run into people, talk to them for a minute, and you may not have known that even one thing you said has inspired that person to maybe be a better person. It doesn't mean everyone you might run into, but we're all important. Life is important. And the reason why I do this channel is because I want to show some of the things that fulfill my life, that excite me. Um, like the, one of the previous videos, the Uinta Highland Trail. I'd hiked that multiple times, backpacking in and enjoying the nature, being away from the wildness of the city and it's great to be up away from that and enjoy nature remember in everything you do you are important someone may look up to you and you may not even know it and you have to realize that life sucks it does but you can make it better by just giving out and trying. I, uh, 
that's kind of the reason why I'm doing the YouTube channel. I want to hopefully inspire someone to be better, to do better, and maybe physically get better too. I mean, I have a that still have that knee that bothers me, but it's only once in a while because I stay active. Even one of the doctors said, oh, you know, if you keep exercising, your arthritis is going to get worse. I'm like, arthritis? That happens because you stop. You don't move. So I keep moving to avoid that. But uh, life is a great experience, a great adventure. We all have things that we like, or maybe we don't yet. But uh, if you can get out and try something, try a little hike. It doesn't have to be three, four, or five miles. Go a quarter mile up a trail, turn around, come back down. You've succeeded for the day. Um, next time you go up, instead of a quarter mile, try and make it up a third of a mile. Turn around and go back down. You've succeeded for the day. A lot of people think that you have to get out there and do these extravagant things. Yeah, I do big things. Like last weekend, I did a 76-mile road bike race. Yeah, that's huge. But you can't do that without training. I've got 2,800 miles of biking behind me. This year alone and I was able to handle that because of that but I didn't start there I started by biking maybe five miles six miles and then gradually bumped it up you can't do big things right away you do and one it hurts the next day and you don't want to do it again and two it's, you may get injured and then you won't want to do it anyway because you'll remember last time I did that, it got hurt. That's part of the reason why you have to increment it. Like when you run, if you want to get into running, don't go run three miles. Walk 10 minutes and run for one. And then after 30 mi minutes, you've basically ran three minutes and walk 30 essentially or close to it next time you go out you run two minutes and walk eight but eventually you'll run the whole time during that 30 minutes not just to start it you go try and do that i know when i've come back to running after i haven't ran for a long time it hurts but I know about it. I feel it. I felt it before. But someone who hasn't, that's not fun. It doesn't feel good to be painful in pain next day. But if you do a little bit at a time, gradually you acclimate, acclimate yourself. It's the same as when it gets hot. It's always harder to do something because you've been used to the cold. Same thing. But, uh, again, back to, <clears throat> is your life important? Very much so. Every person is important to somebody. And you, we all need to remember that. We have done many things in our lives that we don't like about ourselves, and we can be our very worst enemy. Because we'll beat ourselves up way before someone else will. But we have to stop and think and try and be that better person. That's why we're human beings, because we're becoming hopefully better people each day. Trying to help others maybe be a better person or at least make yourself a better person. And uh, in the interim, maybe you've influenced someone without knowing. But uh, 
If you like my videos, give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed yet, subscribe. I'll try and put up videos maybe three, four per month. I'm just getting started in this. I've only got like 10 subscribers, but hope to get more just so that maybe I can be that inspiration for someone to help them move forward. And as you can see, I'm not hiking that fast. Maybe going about one and a half miles an hour because any faster I'd be breathing too fast and I can't talk. <laughs> I could do it faster. I mean, I've done a trail marathon, 26.2 miles down in Moab, which was amazing. But uh, the beauty was amazing. Here, let's look at uh, what I'm seeing right now. It's about dusk now. It is almost nine o'clock. There's back down in the valley. And this is up in North Ogden Divide in the state of Utah. Beautiful, beautiful. Super green right now. This is probably the greenest it's been in a long time because the snowfall was amazing this past year. We hit all kinds of records. So much snowfall. But it was great because we have all of our lakes filled back up. So be good. Inspire someone. Inspire yourself. Go out, try something. Find that something that sparked your desire to be happy. This is JD Adventures. Be happy, man.